All right. Hey, let's go for a spin. Um, go ahead and let's fire up the car here. Notice how the car... Sorry, I just want to kick it down a little idle there. Notice how the car starts right away. Now, the engine is somewhat warm um, because uh, we just got, just got done taking the photos, but uh, the car's timed properly, and you can just, <laughs> if the owner's listening, he'll, uh, he'll, know, he'll know what I'm about to say. You can just tickle that key and just give her a click and she pops right off. It's just so badass. We've all seen those clowns at shows who have to sit there and crank and crank and crank their cars. Most important feature about this car is how well it drives, ladies and gents. It's a vehicle that you can get in and just cruise with. It's quiet. Um, the uh, weather strips, you know, have uh, have a little bit of wear. You'll hear some wind noise as we're going, but the car doesn't rattle, it doesn't have a ton of squeaks, and it's tight. It's really, really tight. Ooh, I guess he's gonna go out in front of me. He's in a hurry to not social distance. What's up, Mr. Escalade? During these unprecedented times here of, uh, you know, safer at home orders by our governors, look, driving these cars has become so important to, to many of us just to get out and, uh, and just have some normalcy. Let's be honest. It's just a feel freaking normal. Um, so for people who don't have an old car right now, I feel, I feel sorry for him because this is an awesome release. Hey, just to glance down, you see we're doing about 55 or so. I'll enter up. I don't know if that Cadillac in front of us will let us. There we go. Yeah, we're doing 60, 65 here. And again, I'm not fighting with the pet or with the wheel or anything. This is a car that you can just drive with a couple fingers. It's, it's so awesome. And look, I know in another video I talked a little bit about uh, about the small block, but those of you who, who know these cars know what I'm talking about. There's nothing like driving the small block cars. They rev higher, they're lighter, they're more nimble, and you don't have to worry about the nonsense that you do with the big blocks, you know, the, the, the Temperamental running, um, they, they need tweaking a little bit more, they run hot, um, and again, you can cruise in this 351 all day, all day long. 3.0 gears, looks like that Cadillac has taken off here a little bit, we'll catch up. Oh, and they're stopping, so... Uh, the owner just crapped his pants a little bit. That's awesome. Gauges work. Hey, uh, oil pressure gauge is working. It doesn't normally work. It's uh, got to be maybe a ground or something somewhere. The owner has, has investigated a few things, um, even replaced the... Uh, this uh, the sensor itself but that didn't do it so maybe it's a ground issue uh, radio works oh I don't have it tuned and I'm not gonna tune it here clock does not work uh, fan speeds I'll be quiet here Hear the different fan speeds working, but it only works in defrost. Must be maybe a, a vacuum issue, but the defroster does work. Uh, cruise works. This is cool. Put my foot off the pedal there. You can see us maintaining around 60. And then um, I don't know if I don't know. I'll just hit the brakes to turn. 
automatic transmission. Uh, this is not a born with block. It is a 71 block that the owner believes maybe was replaced at the factory. Um, maybe a warranty issue or something. That way he believes that the heads are original. If, if someone wants me to check on something on the heads, um, I'll go ahead and do that for you, but uh, I'm just taking, taking the owner's word on that. Uh, transmission and rear end are correct. This is a real Mach 1 car. This isn't a sports roof standard car that uh, is, is made to look like a Mach. All right, gang. I'm just going to ease into the throttle here. You can hear the four barrel open. Turn us around, okay? 